Hi friends, here in this video, I'll be explaining the turning operation. So let's get started. Now, when we say turning operation, it is basically to reduce the diameter of the workpiece. Like for example, initially the diameter is greater. After the turning operation has been performed, the diameter gets reduced. So it is also called as shoulder turning because we are reducing the diameter of the workpiece and the operation is performed in such a way like here we have this workpiece. This workpiece is held in the chuck or we can say the headstock of the lathe machine. Here we have this center which is the lathe axis and then when the workpiece is clamped or it is held in the chuck of the lathe machine, the workpiece is rotated in an anti-clockwise manner along the lathe axis and then the tool, cutting tool is fed to this workpiece. This is the single point cutting tool. The single point cutting tool is fed to this workpiece and then the feed is given, the feed which we are providing with the help of the hand wheel is given parallel to the lathe axis and it goes towards the headstock. So this is the direction of feed. And when the feed is given parallel towards the headstock, then the material gets removed from the workpiece in the form of chips. These are called as chips and if by using this cutting tool, we are giving the depth of cut. It means depth of cut is given by providing a cross feed in the direction perpendicular to the lathe axis. So if we want a rough cut, which is required initially when we are machining. So during the turning operation for the rough cut, the tool is fed in a direction perpendicular to the lathe axis. And when this distance is greater, that is we are taking heavy depth of cut. In that case, more amount of chips would be removed and that is called as rough turning operation. And for rough turning operation, even the coolant is required so that we can easily remove the chips and it acts as a coolant. That is the lot of heat is generated while we are taking the heavy cuts. So we have to use the coolant and when that rough cut has been finished at the same time, if we want finishing operation in that case, the depth of cut which is given is very, very small. And then again, the direction of feed given to the cutting tool is parallel to the lathe axis and we can get smooth finish. So in short, that is the explanation regarding the turning operation basically used to perform to reduce the diameter of the workpiece or to get various steps of diameter also called as shoulder turning. At the end, if you'll find my videos helpful, you all can like, share, comment and subscribe our channel and share it amongst your family and friends. Thanks for watching.